See, look, ISRO never competes with anybody. It is a space community. We don't have any doubt that ISRO is going into the uh, world's market in a big way. This is a possibility for local uh, neighbors, our neighbors, even Middle East, even uh, let us say South American, South African countries, where there is a huge demand. There is, there are ample chances for Indian industry to go and appraise the our resources and our capabilities to enter the global markets. of extending the gratitude and thanks to the ISRO. See, it's after all ISRO, what for it is doing? It is for the community. It is for the citizens. It's all citizen-centric technologies we are bringing for social causes and social upliftment. Because when a community uh, comes forward to thank and to acknowledge the achievements of ISRO, that is a moral boost for the ISRO. So we, do, we should have such kind of many more such kind of events so first is bringing the technology and technology achievers and scientists in front of the people. That is one way we can create demand for ourselves, the expectations, the achievements of ISRO, not only achievements of ISRO. What is the benefits of science, techn space technology, social technology, be it uh, uh, water conservation, be it uh, non, uh, uh, let us say, conventional energy sources like solar. Such kind of technologies, now they are not going much into the public. Government is doing many more such kind of things, you know. Now in Gujarat, I think there is the first state which is going almost every household is covering with solar panel. Okay, such kind of technology should go into the public and more awareness should be generated. And through these events, probably I think such kind of, let us say, reaching out to the people is possible. Do you somewhere feel sir, that ISRO can become the world global hub for the rocket launches in future? See, look, ISRO never competes with anybody. It is a space community. And especially the space community uh, will flourish well with the collaborations. So all space communities are for, we are, inter, we are uh, let us say, collaborating with NASA, JAXA, ESA, every space agency. And growing together is the best option, especially in space. As far as global business is concerned, sir, I have few questions. How Israel is looking at expanding the business? Because when it comes to not only launching rockets, many other countries are also looking forward. See, uh, especially a uh, couple of years back, uh, government of India has made the has announced the space reforms. So with that one, the Indian industry is growing very fast. And not only it covers the uh, Indian business, it is also occupying the uh, global is occupying the global business. And many a startups of late in the last what, two years have seen expanding their offices in Europe, in uh, uh, South African countries, South American countries, and Middle East. So I'm I'm I don't have we don't have any doubt that ISRO is going into the uh, world's market in a big way. Expansion is concerned, sir. Which are the uh, things you are looking? Because we are expecting Gaganyaan also after uh, two three achievements in last two years. Do you think that can be done in a few days, sir? A few years? See, Gaganyaan is already announced because it's already started. Test vehicles started. One all test vehicle flown. Many integrated tests, cell capture drop tests are lined up and uh, G1, G2 missions are lined up. Soon they are going to happen because Gaganyan is, is already on the anvil. Okay? How the uh, other programs are going to occupy the uh, global space uh, business is geospatial. Geospatial and communications. You see, uh, OneWeb has launched 72 satellites from Indian uh, soil through Indian uh, rockets and many more such launches may happen and they are entering into the communication, low, low orbit uh, communication constellations. That is going to generate huge amount of business. This is a possibility for local uh, neighbors, our neighbors, even Middle East, even uh, let us say South American, South African countries, where there is a huge demand. There, is, there are ample chances for Indian industry to go and appraise the, our resources and our capabilities to enter the global markets. We are reaching near to the sun one side, other side we are the fourth nation to uh, uh, drop ourselves on the uh, south pole of the moon.
Do you think it increased the responsibility of the ISRO? Yes, obviously. And the government of India has announced a plethora of, uh, let's say, programs, Man on the Moon and Gaganyan, Bharti Antariksha Station. Uh, our scientific community is working very hard to achieve these uh, goals very soon. So government is also helpful? Government is much, much helpful.